So, have you ever wondered what the brake dock vents do and whether they actually do anything or not? So, we're looking at my 2019 Mini Cooper JCW, and there's a vent on both sides. You're looking at the one I haven't done anything with. So, I decided I've got this nice little a boroscope thingy done by Depth Tech, or however you pronounce it. I have my iPad recording the uh, boroscope, and I have my very scientific DeWalt leaf blower that's guaranteed to move air at something like 280 miles an hour. Uh, well, we don't need that much, and uh, so we've uh, looked down the, the vent with the uh, boroscope, and uh, right now you're probably not going to see too much with this, but uh, we'll show you something like, um, uh, that shows you how it bends and looks straight at the nice red uh, brake caliper. Now I've taken a piece of yarn uh, to show you where the air is blowing and uh, quite interesting. It uh, does blow where you hope it would, at least when the car is standing still. So here we have the boroscope going into the brake duct vent, you'll notice that it sits back a little bit from the uh, front bumper. And we're headed down in through the duct and you notice the bend that it has uh, where it aims towards the brake uh, caliper. Uh, we'll get there in a minute. And there on the left, you can see the brake caliper uh, showing up, and you'll notice that it's aimed right at it. Very nice. Here is a shot of the string being blown out of the brake duct um, using the leaf blower, and this is using the boroscope aimed towards the brake duct or the brake itself. Uh, and you can see with the car standing still, uh, it's, it's aimed perfectly at the uh, brake caliper. So I've added a second string and uh, you can see using the leaf blower that they are both still blowing at, or straight at the brake caliper. This will be the setup for out on the road. So let's see what happens when the car is actually moving. Uh, here I am backing out of the driveway. Uh, this is a good shot of the articulation of the uh, steering uh, while I'm backing up. I'm going through quite a range of motion. You can also see that the uh, tire gets pretty close to the, the brake duct. It's about an inch, maybe an inch and a half away at that point. Um, turned in this direction, you can see the uh, full mechanism from the backside and everything. Uh, an interesting view. So, had to stop a little bit. Now I'm backing up again. You'll notice that uh, there'll be a couple of bumps that's going me going over the, the sidewalk and out into the, the street. Um. So here we are going down the street, I'm probably doing, oh, 15, 20 miles an hour here, and you can see the strings start to pick up. And the first thing that you'll notice is the string is no longer headed straight towards the brake caliper. My guess is the uh, air coming around the tire 
uh, is pushing the air coming out of the brake duct uh, into uh, the wheel well in a way that it now misses the, the caliper. Um, seems like it probably does a pretty good job of cooling those uh, uh, CV joints though. Another stop sign. We'll get going. And you can see that pretty much the speed doesn't make too much difference uh, in the way the string moves. Uh, slight bend in the road. We'll be coming up to another stop here. Good left hand turn. We'll get up to about 40 miles an hour here. You can see that pretty much um, you know, the string gets bounced around a little bit depending on which way the, the wheel is turned. But it pretty much stays aimed at the uh, CV joint. We'll come to a stop for the stop light uh, at the highway I'm going to enter into. We'll get up to about 60 miles an hour, um, 60, 70. Uh, so we've just turned on to the highway there, uh, coming up to speed. The other interesting thing is, is how little motion the uh, suspension actually goes through uh, in you know, traveling down the road, it, it sure feels like it's it's going much more than that. But uh, the lens is staying pretty, pretty uh, stable here. And so that's probably about 65 miles an hour right there. And we'll slow down for the next stoplight. <laughs> Ran into some traffic and I actually have to back up, so I left that one in there. So there you have it. Um, that's the brake ducts working on uh, a JCW Mini Cooper. Hope you enjoyed this.